Of course, the Google CEO painting an altogether altruistic picture of this. He says Dragonfly will still be able to answer well over 99% of the queries put to it, and there are many, many areas where we would provide information better than what's available. Um, surely that's a good thing. That's the, that's the uh, playing devil's advocate there. What would you say to him? Yeah, so I'd say that's a pretty convenient framing for Google. It's now been publicly reported, and in fact, I've seen the censorship... Uh, one of the censorship blacklists that explicitly contains uh, thousands of terms, including the uh, phrase human rights in English. It contains the Mandarin term uh, for Nobel Prize, for student protest, many phrases involving Xi Jinping. This is about the act of suppression of human rights concerns and political organizing of Chinese citizens. And I think to phrase that as some ignorable edge case is extremely disingenuous. And so I think what Google's trying to do is phrase this as something that is irrelevant and they're doing their best to get all the information they can to Chinese citizens. But the fact is they're proactively censoring basic political uh, speech and inquiry. And so I would point to Article 19 of the UN's Universal Declaration of Human Rights, which explicitly protects this kind of information.